don't know, bees are a yellow and black insect that pollinate flowers. But what they also do is they actually help to spread um, the seeds of other plants, which is why um, we now know that bees actually pollinate one third of the food that we eat, which if you think about it is a lot. And then when scientists noticed that bees were dying, they realized they had to do something because otherwise like we would have one third of our food gone completely. So after this, um, uh, the scientists came to a conclusion that a group of pesticides called neon nicotinoids, a group of pest, uh, uh, yeah, as I said, a group of pesticides were linked to the dying bees, and they were actually dying faster than any of the scientists thought that they actually were dying at. So Avaz uh, stepped in and they created a petition to force the EU to ban these this group of pesticides, and. They actually got 2.6 million people to sign this. And then Avaz also helped fund opinion polls. And they ran campaigns against certain countries that opposed it, like Spain and Germany. So they would go to those specific countries and then run campaigns in those countries. And they actually got both Germany and Spain to switch sides. And then the outcome was that the EU actually did agree to ban it. And now that there is a pending sci independent scientific review that is waiting to be like um, taken into place for the ban on neon nicotinoids. And the independent scientific review is basically going to make sure that this group of pesticides is what is actually killing the bees so that the EU knows that this is the thing to ban. Wow, so it's happening. Huh?